In this video, I'm going to show you how to change the username of your WordPress website. There are instances you may want to change the username of your WordPress website. For instance, if you use webmaster or admin as the username and you want to change it to a different name. So in this video, I will show you exactly how to do that. Hello guys, this is Sadiq here at Diku Pages Web, where I do web tutorials just like this one. So if you are new here, consider subscribing. So as I said in the introduction, I'm going to show you how to change the username of your WordPress website. That said, let's jump into the video. So to change the username of my WordPress website, I will go over to Dashboard. Now go over to users so currently this is the user i have and it will be difficult to edit the username so let's go to edit so this is my current username i won't be able to edit it so to change this i'll add a new user so i click on add new and the users so I enter the new username I want to use and I need a new email address I can enter my first name and last name then in here I can generate a password or just enter my preferred password I'll hide it first I don't want to send notification to the user because it's my email address and the rule I drop down the arrow and choose administrator then I click on add new user so the new user is created if I hover on the new user you see that there's delete option here but if I go to the previous user I don't see delete and the reason is that I've logged in with this particular username. So what I'm going to do is I'll log out out of this account and I'll log in with the new user. Now I've logged in with the new user. So I'll go back to users. Now if I hover on the new user, there's no delete option. But if I go to the previous user, I have delete option right here. If you look at the far end of the previous user, you see that there's one post assigned to that user. So let's see what happens if we are going to delete that user. So I click on delete. Now WordPress will give me the option to delete all content or to attribute all content to the new user. This is what I'm going to do. If I click on delete all content, every single content that the previous user created will be deleted. And that's not what I want. So I click on attribute all content to the new user. I click on confirm deletion. So the previous user name has been deleted. And now I have this user as the main user. So this is how you change the username of your WordPress website. That is, if you want to change from one particular name to another. I hope this video was helpful. If you found value, kindly hit the like button, subscribe, and also enable the notification bell so that each time I post a new video on this channel, you'll be the first to know. Keep watching, and we will talk soon.